we're fixing for you. Um, it's the mobility in my this arm. Right. I can't. <laughs> okay, so if you can, <laughs> yeah, stand up and we'll, yeah. we'll just show that to the camera. So show us your good arm. Oh, my good arm can go up there. Yeah, lovely. And the not so good arm. Right, just to your bum. Right, let's sit there. Right, okay. Uh, so the surgeon said yes, so the energy now has been done, what we needed to do in the shoulder. Uh, the purple powder, what can I tell you about it? I've been taking it for three years, it's amazing. Um, in New Zealand, there's certain things I can say about the product. In the UK, I'm very, very limited what I can say. All I can say is, guys, try it for yourselves, see what it does for you. I use it before the healings uh, to put more energy into the cells. Um, it's a kind of product that doesn't need to go through your digestive system, it can go into the bloodstream on the Krebs cycle, and so it's very good at putting energy in the cells. <coughs> and loads and loads and loads of frozen shoulders, injured shoulders over the years, getting forwards movement, sideways movement, it's easy peasy, getting the backwards <coughs> movement, mm, can be a bit trickier, but not with these guys hopefully tonight. Okay, so let's just get you trying that again, so if you can stand face that way and try that movement again, looks <coughs> like to get somewhere, that's it, it happens in layers, it happens in layers, but we're ready, to... how's it feeling in the shoulder itself? It feels, it's kind of tight there. Yeah. And moving it. Yeah, cool. And we've got a hot stuff in the shoulder. Right. Now notice the clicking fingers, that means it's a thought, they're working on the level of thought. So because they've been working with me now for so long, <coughs> but this is the interesting thing, even though they've worked with me so, for so long, I don't think, oh I can do this and do it myself. Very rarely. I just hand over to them, especially when I'm doing a show, because I want them to show what's possible. Right, uh, now if you want to stand and give it another go. Yeah, a bit higher again. Cool. <coughs> God bless. All right, just a change of surgeon. All right, so now, so sometimes when they work, they're just removing energy. Other times it's a psychic surgery and there's a scalpel or more commonly I see a little tiny pair of scissors and they just snip away at energy. Now that's interesting. They've actually gone under the arm, not into the shoulder at all, but they've done a little snip in the underarm. E to see what movement there is there. Yay, we're getting there, aren't we? Show us a good one again. Yeah, cool. Mm -hmm. Right. They might not get it as good <coughs> as your first arm, you know, the one that's good, but we've got a, a little bit more they can do. God bless. All right. So I see things in my mind's eye. Uh, that last healing pass, they put some padding actually in there, energetic padding. Now they're pressing down what looks like press studs. Do I mean press studs? Uh, on the, I don't mean press studs, like, almost like drawing pins actually, down a, in a line across the shoulder. E now, this next time, what I want you to do is move both arms together. So. What I mean is like this. Yeah. yeah. Well, I wish. <laughs> Get as far as you can. There's a reason for this. Uh, cool. Yeah, so let me just make it I'll make it a little bit easy. So just yeah, just bring both arms up like that. How are we going? Cool. That's not bad. It's not bad, is it? Right, and then sit down again. Now the reason that we're doing that is I've learned over the years is that in here we get an idea of what 
what this is like and what it can do. And if we move the other arm, um, you're giving the brain more than one thing to do. And when you move both arms together, all of a sudden it, it just joins some dots and suddenly you've got good movement for it. For <coughs> now I've got a lot closer now to the physical body and that's significant. So uh, usually on a healing, I will start further out and I'll move further in. God bless. Now, can you feel anything happening in that shoulder? Um, it feels vibrating. It's vibrating. Cool. E now, you have got uh, an amazing uh, psychic surgeon in the UK. He's called Stephen Turoff. I've seen him four times as a client or with people that I've needed to take to him. And this was before my own abilities developed. He's absolutely amazing. Um, so if ever I'm not in the country and need to see somebody, it's Stephen Turoff, T-U-R-O-F-F, he's brilliant. E another well-regarded healer. They are around. Uh, my own personal teacher when I trained with the National Federation of Spiritual Healers was a guy called Jack Angelo. But the healing I do isn't NFSH healing, it's spirit surgery. It's a different modality. E and Jack Angelo has written a wonderful book called Your Healing Power. It's a very good first read if you're wanting to learn how to be a healer. E right, one more try, let's see how we're doing. Double, yeah, double one. <laughs> cool. Don't necessarily try and do the thing, it's just to get both arms moved. So more like that. That's cool, but that's enough for now. That's, yeah. They've done what they can yeah. for this session. Give yeah. a round of applause.